Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com, and today we're going to show you how to load Honeycomb, which is Android 3.0, on the Nook color using the USD method. Okay, before you begin, you must have done our how to root the Nook color auto neuter method. If you haven't, you can click on that link there to be taken to that. Finish that procedure, and then you can come back to this one. Uh, right now, this method uh, that's used for loading Honeycomb safely uh, involves turning an SD card into a bootable drive, loading the Honeycomb image onto it, and then putting it in your Nook color and having that boot off of the SD card. Now, the cool thing about that is that it doesn't actually touch the operating system on the Nook. If you take out the SD card, you boot back into normal mode, um, so it's very risk proof, I guess, um, because the Nook color automatically boots off of the SD card first, and then it boots off of its regular thing. So that's kind of nice. Uh, for this, you will need a 4 gig micro SD card or larger because the Honeycomb image is about 3 point something gigs as it stands right now. Um, you'll also need an external SD card reader, but if you have done our how to root the Nook color procedure, you already have that SD card reader because you needed it for that as well. Okay, so since you've already done our how to root the Nook color using the auto neuter method uh, procedure, this is going to be pretty easy for you because it's very similar to that. You need to download the Honeycomb image for Nook Color first, though. So click on this link here. It's going to take you to the developer's actual uh, post that he did. So it's deeper blue. And here's his changelog, etc. Here is the actual download file. So click this one, whichever is the latest one. Save that to your computer. Okay, so once that downloads, we're going to find that .zip file. And we're going to right-click it and extract it. and wait for it to extract. Okay, and once it's done extracting, it should have its own little folder, and inside should be a .img file. Okay, so we're going to take that 4 gig card, that has to be 4 gig or larger, remember, and we're going to put it into our USB micro SD adapter, which has an SD card in here, which has a slot for your micro SD card, and then it goes into here, and now we can use it as a jump drive. Okay, now we're going to take that SD adapter and plug it into the computer. Okay, and then we're going to open WinImage, which is the program we used in uh, the how to root method. So I'm going to right click that and run as administrator. Click OK. Ok, then we're going to select disk. Restore virtual hard disk image on physical drive. Select our SD card reader. Click OK. We're going to change this to all files. And then you can see I went inside Nook honey.img, found the actual .img file, click open, hit yes, and close that, and wait for it to finish flashing. Okay, so once that's done, you're going to turn off your Nook color entirely, and we're going to take out the SD card from behind the computer, and take it out of its little adapter put it inside the nook while it's off and then you're going to plug the nook in real quick to your computer via USB which will cause it to turn itself on and wait for it to boot up Okay, and after a few seconds, you'll be presented with the Honeycomb unlock screen. And then you'll have Honeycomb running on your device. Enjoy!